Have you ever come across a recipe that calls for fennel bulb and wondered, well, what the heck is that? And once I find this fennel bulb, how do I prep it? Well, stay with us, we'll show you how. Okay, so this is fresh fennel, and a lot of times people call it um, celery on steroids. And it does look a little bit like celery, but the bottom here, the, the bulb is what you're actually going to be using most and eating most. The stalks look like celery, but they don't act like celery. They are very, very tough and very fibrous. You can use them in soups um, as you're simmering them to add a little bit of very light fennel flavor like you might get from fennel seeds, but you need to remove them. You need to yank those guys out of there. Um, also the fronds here, these little feathery, delicate things, these are wonderful uh, for garnish. You can use them like herbs. And so you can just pull those off and see how lovely those are. Those are great sprinkled over a finished dish. So to prep this guy, you want to look and see if there are any kind of blemished outer leaves, and there is here. So I'm just going to yank that off. And if there's any more blemish, we can trim it off as we go. So like I said, the stalks are very tough, so I want to get rid of those guys. And oh gosh, you can see they're so tough it's hard to even cut them off. So I'm not using these guys. I'm going to throw them over here. And so I have this bulb here that's left. And as you work with the bulb, you'll see there's a real hard core in the middle. And we need to get rid of that because it's very, very tough. So when you cut in, you see it's almost like a cabbage. There's a core here that sort of holds everything together. And you know, sometimes you want um, a little bit of that. Like if you're roasting fennel wedges, you don't want everything to fall apart. That core holds all the layers together. So if you're roasting fennel wedges and you want them to stay together, just trim out a little bit of that core because it's very, very tough in the center, but you still have enough of it on there to kind of hold everything together so it doesn't fly apart. And then you can roast these guys. They stay together. That's great. Now, if you're dealing with a recipe that calls for, um, say, sliced fennel for a salad, you should get rid of all of that core because, again, it's very tough. So I just take my knife and I do like that, take out that little triangle of the core, and now you see everything is free. The layers separate, everything's great. You can just slice that up. These are vertical slices of fennel. Crunchy, wonderful, crisp, and great in salads. That's it.